Well, hello there, my delicious friends, and welcome back for a little bit more Cyberpunk 2077. We are out in the sticks, we are rough and ready, and we have been spending our time starting to buy these bad boy modified hardcore off-road nomad cars. I love them, they've got a real nice attitude, however, we need to be saving up a lot more money to buy a lot more of these cars. We're going to do that by checking out the Michiones in this area. We're going to stick with story-based stuff to keep it interesting, and just vibe for the afternoon. Welcome on in. Welcome on in. Let's check out these nomad specific stories and track our way around. And also this bad boy is chunky and weighty and really good off-road as well. How are you guys doing live on twitch.tv forward slash Mikey Mega Mega? I hope you're well. So we are out right in the wastelands where everything is miserable. And then there's one gas station in the middle of nowhere and a bus stop. Oh, it's assault in progress. Okay, one sec. There's an active crime. Also, some cars which look like they might be a lot of fun to steal. Okay, so we've got a petrol station. We've got people by the petrol station. Let's breach their protocols, get inside of their business. I love this game so much. Let's go in hard. I have this lovely looking assault rifle that we picked up at the end of the uh, other Let's Play. And uh, my murder gun with burning and my murder uh, assault rifle with burning. I'm a very burny boy. Very flame orientated. Okay, let's, uh, <gasps> yo, let's just do this. I can blow up one of these pumps. You and I she just stood there and took that. <laughs> They're both just like, hmm, that blew up, <laughs> that blew up in my face. Okay, uh, obviously not the brightest uh, pack of businesses in town. I'm just gonna drop a cheeky contagion, let them uh, infect each other's lives. Oh, well, what's going on in here? Oh! Oh, they're robbing the shop! Okay. It should be easy enough. Someone take their position! Oh! Oh no, I down! Oh, I wanted to be a big boy and monomolecular mono molecular fiber whip them. Okay, this time, can I just run them straight over? Lovely. There's many ways to peel a chicken. And sometimes you can just do it with a real violent bit of driving. 7A1C55. E9, 1C, 55. Perfect. Inside their business. Reaper smiles on you. Oh, she's tagging and spray painting. Yeah, it's very naughty. Okay. Infectious uh, diseases. Oh, fuck. I, I nearly shot the clerk. Is this glass bulletproof? Hey. We've uh, done it. Let's just make sure nobody lives to tell the tale of how the saviour, Mikey Mega Mega, came in here. Handguns, upgrade components, archive conversation in Euro dollars. Ooh, and 2,800 monies. Third engine this month. It can't be a fucking coincidence. Where did you fill up? What's I got to do with it? Just tell me where you stopped for gas. It's that guy by the dump. <gasps> he was watering down the fuel and he admitted it. Wow, they were writing the conversation that happened like seconds ago. Somebody's really good at keeping journals and diaries in this game. So this dude, you've been watching- Shit. Thanks, stranger. That was a close one. But you kind of bought this on yourself because you were getting a bit cheeky. Oh, that's fascinating. Oh yeah, main point was that I wanted to steal one of their cars. Look at this. Yeah, this looks pretty uh, cheeky and juicy. Let's go. How's Cyberpunk feeling these days? Worth a revisit, Kibble? Yes. I took a massive break from this game. Oh! Oh, this is really responsive. Oh, I like this. I took a big break from the game. Um, and uh, I've only just started picking it up again. And after a day of getting back used to the controls and the kind of vibe, I realized that I was really hungry again to dive back in. So, yeah. Yo! It's very suspicious around here. Yo, we're kind of out in the middle of nowhere. This is a little bit like where we died and came back to life. Let's follow this path. I just want to have a quick look and then we'll go back and we'll do the mission. My opinion of this game is very much from the point of view of someone with a fairly powerful PC. Uh, it's never been truly game broken for me. So I've uh, I've noticed a hell of a lot of glitches and problems, but um, I have an overall positive opinion of this game. <gasps> yes, this is it. By Jove, we've done it! That's Dex! Oh my god, yo, 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 let's check Dex's corpse. 
This is where Takimura killed Dexter and pulled us out of misery after the very end of part one of the game. Dexter D. Sean. He's got a gun, plan B power pistol. It's not that powerful, but we will take it. And then did Dex have like a helper guy? He's probably not so important. Can I pick up the body? No, only the gun. See you in hell, Dex. You deserve what you get. So I died and I was like, I was down here in the rubble somewhere. Hey, I'm so glad we found that. That's really fucking cool. It's a great time to be alive. How are you? Yo, what is this? Okay, car salvage yard. Who knows what you might find. Let's go in on foot. Hello? Avi, I have some new work for you. A certain item needs to be salvaged from the landfill before some gonks chop it to pieces. I've attached some more details for you. Hmm. Interesting. This Joe kid has talent, knows his hooks and jabs. I swear he could knock a horse's teeth out. Kids got it what it takes to be a pro. The coaches aren't easy to come by in the Badlands. There's next gen sparring robots in the scrapyard. Oh, okay. Go get the bot. The guy that runs the landfill, watch out, he's a real piece of work. I like murdering pieces of work. Okay, so I'm gonna sneak in here, watch out for any robot guard dogs. And then we'll see what there is to see. So we've got some boyos who run this landfill. As ever, hacking our way. Perfect. Someone just over here as well. All right, let's ping everyone. Okay, network data hub. Cheeky garage, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven boyos. Okay, there's quite a lot of business and people around here. We might do some um, silent murdering before anything else. A bit of safe scamming, my lord. Oh yeah. You go look at that car. Nice. I go murder now. Just innocent people working here, and yet still, I will kill them all. Got two gems over there, but I reckon this guy over here is an easier kill first. Oh shit, he's moving. Is it turn away? Turn. <laughs> I'm so clearly definitely here. Didn't see a thing, bruv. Okay. Just gonna back out away from those boyos over there. Avoid some lines of sight. Get the kill. Okay. Steal from the body. Just gonna lug this over here a little bit. There we go. There we go. What's in here? Uh, yo! This person's just physically in the floor. Can I still kill them? I've released you from your bonds. What kind of build are you running? I went full Netrunner on mine. Uh, made the game a little too easy. Uh, Netrunner, huh? I might be doing something a bit similar. I am evil corpo, but also I'm heavily focused into uh, hacking and tech. So most of my points, like I've got really low body strength skills. I'm not that cool and I've got no reflexes. I haven't even checked what happens in reflexes, um, but I've been smashing through my hacking and breaching of networks. And also technical abilities for a bit of kind of uh, technical guns and upgrading weapons. I'm probably going to set off one of these distractions to see if one of them comes over. Let's try this one. I want them to walk all the way around, ideally. Oh shit, that was something. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> okay, he was medium distracted by that. Careful. Stay low, stay low, stay low. I might go for another distract. I'm worried that this guy... Oh, he's sitting down. He might be doing a number two. As long as this guy doesn't stand up in line of sight me, I should be able to do something cheeky to this dude. Uh, I'm just going to give him a little long-range stealthy boy. One of my personal favourites. Can I hack the very tip of his head? I'm going to literally just shut down his entire system. Come on, stop bobbing and weaving. You're not boxing, mate. System reset. So this is what I'm talking about, uh, being borderline god. I've just turned off all of that guy's electronics and also his nervous system. 
Okay, good so far. Strong. Strong. Uh, I'm just going to reset this man. His friend might notice the problem. His friend does not notice the problem. Can I get in for the sneak? Don't turn around, don't turn around. Don't turn around, don't turn around, don't turn around. I believe. Brilliant. That's almost everyone. We're being paid to kill these people. Therefore, morally acceptable. What is all that noise? Okay, let's just go in and shoot him to death. Let's just mess him up. Hey. Oh. Oh, I'm in a safe area. Wait. Oh, now he thinks I'm just a customer. Oh my god, don't tell me I didn't need to kill anyone. Did I... He's just living his life being nice to me. I killed a lot of people. And because I silent killed them, I never really checked to see if anybody was trying to harm me. The music, so the music sounds like it's high pressure. Listen to that music. With that kind of music, you obviously have to murder people. Oh, I might have made a terrible, terrible assumption about the nature of this mission. Oh, I murdered all of them and the music's gone away. Now there's a dialogue option. <laughs> oh, there's a dialogue! <laughs> With any luck, they'll hey, try to shoot me. Selling anything interesting? <sighs> that depends on what you're interested in. Oh no, please don't tell me I can just buy the robot. Oh my god, you're right, they are scamming me. The prices here are really inflated. At a gun shop, I was buying these for way less. Oh, you guys are actually right. I am actually getting conned here. Training bots. Yes, I have one. But only for sale. And it won't be cheap. Okay. 31,000 euro dollars. 31,000! Okay. I'm going to murder him because I do not actually have enough money. Which therefore validates all of my murdering. Okay. Hmm, I see. You look at this dump and think I'm some piece of loser trash, huh? What's she holding? You can just come here and try to fuck me. Contact! Contact! Oh! There we go. I feel completely validated. I insta murdered this man with my hacking. Every single other person here is already dead. They're already dead. Ah, oh, good. Murdering was the right choice after all. This is fine. Have they fixed all the bugs? No. It gives the game more flavor, actually. Oh, pull the shard from the bot. Okay. Deposit the shard in the drop point. Oh, wait, it's Mars Way. Oh, so they don't want the training bot. They just want the training bot's CPU. Okay, let's grab a car. Hey, here's my boyo. Lovely to see you. Place was a dump and he was loser trash. Couldn't even keep an ex corpo from breaking all the IC. Yeah, man. I'm in there. I'm in the business. It's been a productive day. Oh, and if it isn't the uh, same quickie mark that I liberated earlier. I'm a liberator. Did a lot of quiet liberating people in the neck earlier. Job complete. Okay, it works. I don't know why there's two slots, though. But at least Red Joe has something to train with, and that's what matters. Contract closed. Let's drop off some of those excess weapons and bits as well. Get that sweet money. Oh, Dexter Deshaun's pistol is actually um upgradable. It's a rare iconic. Oh, I didn't realise when we were looking at it. How are you lovely people doing? How's your weekend going? What are you guys up to? Anything good? Any plans? Any artwork? Thanks for joining the nighttime rubbish tip adventure. That mountain is purely artificial. This is fine. Perfect. Mm. Oh, Judy! Judy. So, you got a plan? Damn right I do. Come over to mine tonight. Gonna lay the groundwork with Tom and Roxy. They're with us. Michael will be here too. Oh, she's gonna take How over the territory. That? Got something really big. Tell you everything tonight. Last thing, what do you like on your pizza? 
Oh, she's being... We get pizza now. Judy didn't care about us until she needed us. But now that I'm useful to her and her plans to take over the prostitution gambit, I get a... Tofu tuna and pineapple. Locust pepperoni, please. Locust pepperoni. And lots of extra cheese. Mmm. boy. She's way more flirty than she used to be. I'll be there. So, Judy's story arcs opened up another thing that we're going to um, vibe into in a little bit. But first, I appear to be here to infiltrate the Wraith's territory. I'm assuming to murder them all. <gasps> With my favourite murder method, taking control of a turret gun. Now, there's a lot of explosives and mine traps around here. We've got this boyo here. Let's start pinging them. Network hub over there. One, two, three, four, five, six people that I can see. Let's just see how we go. I'm going to ruin this guy's day, firstly. Lovely. This guy's charging a gun turret, which isn't very smart. Oh god, they're really fucking tough! Oh, how tough is this guy? I think we're going to be alright. As long as... Oh my god, I'm really glad that I'm not getting involved head on. This That guy's taking a lot of big shooting. Oh god, I really hope they don't notice where I'm hiding. Yeah, this is fine. Just keep murdering. Yeah. Let's go around this side. Ah, <gasps> Is that my best friend? Gun turret number two? I'm so glad to see you. Is that gun turret shooting at me? Oh, yep, 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 yep. Should I use some smart bullets on this gentleman? I just need to get him logged on the gun. There we go. <gasps> Yo, this gun shoots quick. Look at that. Shoot up, let the bullets drop in. This smart gun is using way better tracking software than some of the guns that I've had earlier. And it fires at a much faster rate. It's a common item, but we might hold on to it because its stats are good. Oh, hello there. Lovely. I love a gun that does a bit of burning damage. This guy's coming around, so I'm just gonna stay down here. And... Look what I've picked up. Look what Mikey has. Yes. Oh, this has been very fruitful so far. You better believe I'm going to try to put this in the trunk of my car. Well, I've infiltrated the area because I've murdered everyone. Who's this? It's took you long enough. Iris Tanner. I'm supposed to get you out of here. They didn't hurt you? No, we were still in the negotiation phase. They made a pretty solid case, so it was only a matter of time. Push came to shove, I'd rather slave under Raffin than be chopped into little pieces. Good negotiations. We best get a move on. I'm not going anywhere without my ride. It's sitting in the garage. That wasn't in the spec. At least tell me it's fast, this ride of yours. No, it wasn't the spec. And no, it's not particularly fast either. Let's say it's between you and me, huh? I'll make it worth your while. We'll see how things play out. Okay, so she wants me to fetch her car, which worries me because I want to put this big gun into the trunk of my car. Oh, hello. Hello. Did I just pick up an epic handgun? I did. Yo, we need to mess around in the Badlands a bit more often. Look at this. Reaper smiles. Look how dodgily stacked on top of vehicles that mobile home is. I can't go out and get my own car because she'll follow me out and then I won't have gotten her Dakota, which appears to be optional. So let's do this first. But remind me, I need to come back in and hack and take everything. Is this... Is this on fire? <laughs> We've left without the hood. <laughs> we left the hood up. Is that supposed to do that? Flawless game, everybody. 
There we go. Just that's, that's how they work. Alright, let's get out of here before we get shot. Okay. Take her to the road. Get out. She's getting some shut eye. I'm gonna leave her a quick sec. Go back. Big gun. Live my dreams. Oh wait, I still have it. Am I still holding the big gun? Oh no, it's disappeared out of my gun selection. Oh, every time I get a massive gun, the game somehow conspires to take it away from me. Oh, sad times. Combat wire, smart gun. Mmm. Interesting time. Oh, here it is. Here it is. We found it, everybody. It gets dropped by the truck when we got into the truck. Fantastic. Oh, this this day just keeps getting better. Okay, I'm going to march this all the way back down to the front and call my car. Mikey, look at his gun's special ability. Special ability? Bullets have a higher chance to apply bleeding, but keep an eye on your wallet. Every shot costs you eddies. <gasps> what? Firing this gun uses money. I'm so glad you said that. <laughs> oh, wow. I could have shot myself straight out of my mortgage. Fuck. Dexter Day Sean. He never stops fucking you over. Even from the grave, he's still screwing me over. Dex, my boy. Here he comes. Here he comes to save the day. Here he comes. Heavy machine gun. Yes, pats on back all round, everybody. I'm very pleased with how that's turned out. Okay, love. Uh, you wanted me to drive you around in your van? You got it. I think that's bad. Wait till Disney start doing the social credit score. You'll be allowed to watch Disney movies. But if you say bad things about Disney and its conglomerates, then uh, no more cinema access. Yo, so this is Dakota's vibe. So this must be part of like her nomad crew that keep an eye on stuff. If I lose again today, I will kick someone hard. Interesting bunch. What you playing at? Mmm, good chat. Oh, Dakota. Oh my brother. Hup. Dakota, Iris Tanner, as per your request. Sister. Cut the bullshit, all right? I'm no one's sister. Just tell me what I have to do. After that, we're even. Where is your car? Ask your brother. Yeah, Jimmy. V? Oh, I need to park the car in the garage. Mm, one sec. Sorry, I didn't realize. Perfect. Like a glove. Sorry about that. You'll get new equipment. Oh, no, I think that's fine. V, V? Thank you for the assistance. See, she. I'm listening. She doesn't actually like me whilst when I'm a corpo. Someone said she's much nicer to you when you're a nomad. Tell me about the Badlands. Not much going on out here, huh? Oh, contraire! If you use your eyes and ears, this is an ecosystem. Nomads, Raff and Shiv, corporations and drifters—they form a complete whole. Remove one part, the delicate balance topples. Uh, here's my appreciation. I stashed a little something for you in the drop point by Sunset Motel. Oh, I get a little something something. Yeah, boy. Okay, let's uh pick up our bountiful award, shall we? You guys are right. Oh, wait, are you prostitutes? You've got that prostitute lean. <gasps> Her nipples are almost showing. Look at that. Only honey, I can help. Uh, I won't. Sorry, I'm not going to bother that guy. He's clearly, <laughs> he's clearly in the middle of something. Is this my car over here? God, how embarrassing. It was here all along. Look at my two bad boys. All right, let's go. Someone kick him. How are you doing? Yeah, this game, when it works, is really, really fun. It's... Wait, my car's... Did my car just drive over there on its own? You belong to me. Please don't drive away. Yeah, this game is incredible. And every single time I drive around the city or just investigate some random area and find that it's full of detail and stuff it reminds me that an incredible amount of work has been put into this game it, it really is it's not perfect it's not a truly great game it's just a really 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 good game it might be great one day when they uh, really just wrap things up but it's really just something to totally immerse yourself into if you want to down by sunset, huh? This must be it. Mm, what you say? 
job complete. 1300 euro dollars. Well, that's all right. It's not a huge amount of money. I'll make 1300 euro dollars just by hacking somebody's network. Judy wants us to go um, and help her start raiding places, right? So let's actually just double check that on the old mission log as well. My car's having some trouble existing now. Maybe we're actually going to start affecting real change in the horrible cyberpunk world. Or just, you know, help fuel the endless turf wars. Oh, sorry, dude. He kind of died on his own there. <laughs> but make up the city. I better get out of here before the police turn up. Back into the big city. The bright lights. Don't worry, this car's very robust, thankfully. Okay, this is where she lives. What a perfect flawless drive. 10 out of 10. Oops, sorry. Police warrant issued for murdering that person. Ooh, just, let's just pretend. Let's pretend that last person didn't happen. Don't tell, don't tell Julie I murdered someone outside her flat. Hey V, come on in. Pizza's getting cold. Ah, he was the guy who worked in the um, Joy Toy prostitute bar. Uh, we're in the kitchen. When we were hunting for... Um, you made it. Good. Evelyn. Grab a seat. I don't... This is Roxanne. Oh, Roxanne, She's hi. She's clouds longer than any of us. Hello. Yeah, you look it. <laughs> hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. Tom, how you doing, man? How are Hello. you? Okay, I guess, but, you know, sad as hell. Mm. Were you and Evelyn close? Yeah. Blew up in her face when she showed up back at Clouds. She was supposed to be long gone, the one who got away. But deep in my heart, I was glad to see her back. Mm. I feel like such a gonk now. Because of your desires, your friend has died. You are responsible. You're a bad person. Oh. You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? So she's the head of a moxie gang, I guess. So, change your mind, huh? Quickly, too. I'm here. Doubt I need to explain why. It's far by shouting all my plans from the window. By the way, Boris didn't show up for work today. Or yesterday. No shit, I wonder why. He's not coming back. Doubt I need to explain why to you. Me? I've got no idea why. Remember that. Done saying hello to each other? We murdered him. I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier solo. Fascinating, oh. isn't it? That's like but a nen ability. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. Oh god, that sounds kind of horrific. Yeah, that's in uh, Hunter Hunter. Got to see it to believe it. Finally, someone said it. Um Um Tom Could you not fucking do that, please? Uh, sparring's not actually my strong suit. Test out his combat skills. Just don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. I think he's about to beat my face in. How do I block? Oh, fuck! Ah. You there? Can you hear me? Oh, yo. <laughs> Look at me go! You see that? Uh, I'm all out of questions. Gotta do some hey. cardio. Okay, okay. That probably sells it. The chip works. Let's get to it then. You've got an elite force of three muscle heads and a techie. Hiromi Sato. Who's that? Cloud's real boss. He rarely shows, but you can't so much as sneeze without him finding out. Claws trust him, respect his opinion. He is one of them. We can try to convince him, but it's doubtful. We stand a better chance by injecting him with a dose of fear. Where do we find this Hiromi? At his apartment, H8 Mega Tower, topmost floor. It's a penthouse, almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. It's just my work. 
If we get him in his apartment, where he thinks he's completely safe, bosses will understand what we're looking to demonstrate. My, my. There's a flickering in that skull sponge of yours after all. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I... I need to think about it. Never wasted anyone before, you know. Is she gonna betray us? V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Yeah, let's get Sticking in trouble. Precious necks out for a bunch of whores. Come on, you're for punk anarchist. Count me in, Judy. I already said I'd help, didn't I? Yo. Is Johnny Silverhand hurting my relic on purpose? Because he doesn't agree with me. Shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do will usually come to the price tag, I know. Blowjobs. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. BJ's Feels met. Like it's only right. Come on. I'm not going to force you. Okay, I'm not a scumbag. But if you're willing to BJ your way out of debt, we could both have a great time. I am tripping balls right now. Uh, 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 v, everything okay? V, you don't look so hot. It's for Relic. I'm dying. The heist Evelyn hired us for? The Relic I was going to collect. <sighs> Couldn't forget that in a million years. That biochip. Well, long story short, it had Johnny Silverhand's mind on it. An engram of it that's overriding my mind. You being serious? Truly wish I wasn't. Fuck. Anything at all you can do? Did that just lag? It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Cheers. Sounds great. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Make yourself at home. Yo, let's pass out. In good old Judy's house. Hmm. That's a good sign. She's just hired me to help her out in a very dangerous takeover mission. And I've just told her I'm really sick and I need to take a nap but she's full of confidence now eat breakfast optional yeah we knew that from ages ago that's fucking Shinra think that's how she winds down did he just say Shinra as in as did he just use Shinra as a positive term is that a Final Fantasy reference like that's fucking Shinra what is uh, the kanji that makes up Shinra in uh, Final Fantasy 7 oh, Chick's got taste. That mm -hmm. all you have to say? And she's nice. Six out of ten. Six out of ten, okay. That's a pretty good seal of approval. Okay, I think this time we are ready to go cause some trouble. Let's get back into the muddy dream zone. So, God, we really did tour the city just to get to Julie's. Whilst we're here, actually, then, this one, get in, get into trouble. Let's go. Quick gig. Maelstrom clapped a Malorian van. They're holding it in one of their hideouts. Address I attached. Go there and nab the shard from that van. Other words, you're clapping from the clappers. Need more info? Scan the attachment. Okay, a simple stealing job will be all right. Hack them, ping them, scan them. Same old, same old. Lovely. Cameras down, ice picks in, mass vulnerability is set. Let's let that load up. All right. Let's try to tank on. He just he just fell over the body. So this is the handgun that's costing me money. Let's use this gun and see how much money it costs me to start killing. Twenty-seven thousand three five four. Oh, it it doesn't use a lot of money. It's not outrageous. It's just like a f couple of eddies per round. Let's try this other handgun. So it's a charge gun, a tech weapon, and it can fire through boxes. Good to know, because we're executing people. So what about this person then? Can I go through this material? I can go through the material. Man, these guys don't stand a chance. I'm just experimenting on them like a evil murder man. Uh, data shard. Oh, it's Corporate Wars for musical. 
Powdery. <gasps> Something epic. Powder. Powder. Ha, 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 ha. My corporation on my back. Oh dear. Oh, shards here. Okay, data bank done. Leave the area. Next up. So, guys, yes, indeed. We've wrapped that one up. Thank you very much for joining me. We will do a few more of the cheeky side missions and jobs in this area just because we're here. We'll double check out this car and see what it looks like in the next episode before we make our way back to the Badlands and continue Operation Get All The Cool Nomad Cars. I'll see you then. Take care.